friend, welcome back to Auto Resource YouTube channel. And this will be a very quick video on how to replace a battery in the Viper Alarm Remote. The model here is 7145V. And this is how you proceed. If you look around that remote, there is a space on this edge for a screwdriver. It's right here. Right? And that will be the way to open it, to split these two parts and get the battery out. So let's go and see how it will go on this remote. Right? Now I will twist that screwdriver and look at it. It did split these two cases nicely and I can continue with my hands. Trying to watch the camcorder, the camera, so I'm not paying much attention to the remote unfortunately, but it will open. I will continue on the other side. Could use the screwdriver too, right? Help myself. So you can see it starts splitting, right? And that will help me to separate, and it just happened, these two parts. And here you can see, actually with me, that it's not one battery, but this remote actually uses two batteries. So now we open it and how you replace them. It's very, very simple. You just slide them sideways, right? This is the one, the top one, and there is a one more underneath. It's not being held any special way. You can even turn it upside down and the battery is out. So these are Panasonic's and they are correct CR2016. So now how you put the new ones in. And it's the same how we took it apart and I will demonstrate it with these two batteries which I just removed because I just checked them. These are 3 volt batteries and both of them are over 3 volts so there's no reason to replace them. I'm just making this video for you. I realize there's none on YouTube therefore some of you own these remotes you might be afraid to damage it or something so I'm making this video, right? You can already see both batteries are there. It should be flashing blue, right? If I push on it, as you can see hopefully, right? That blue color. So it's perfectly working. And I, everything is clean again. So I will put this holder, the keychain holder there. And basically I prefer to start from here, right? But you just carefully follow the contour of the alarm and start squeezing it together, right? Just pay attention to the detail, everything is in the place. And you should hear that clicking around, right, as it closes. Did you hear that large click? And looking around, following this line around, I can see it perfectly connected. I'm pulling on this. It's there and that's it. So very, very simple. Now you know all the details and I, sh I wish you good luck replacing your own batteries. Thanks for watching and have a great day.